introducing the term race or ethnicity into conversations about early Christianity is pretty difficult, I think. Uh, it's probably easier and more accurate to talk about ethnicity. There's not this uh, theorizing about race that we see uh, much later and in ways that can be quite, quite detrimental, uh, to put it mild, to under, you know, understate things considerably. There is a concern about ethnicity, and uh, particularly, obviously, around Jew and Gentile, which already is a Jewish way of putting things. Uh, people running around in Rome who were what we call Gentiles didn't say the world is divided between uh, Jew and Gentile. They talked about Greeks and barbarians, people who could speak Greek versus people who couldn't. Right? Uh, but as early Christians saw it, the, the question was, are Gentiles admitted to this Jewish phenomenon on the same grounds? as uh, Jews, and if so, what, is, what does that mean, right? What does that mean for being Jewish? And I think Paul here walks a, um, a very fine line. This is a very controversial question in New Testament scholarship, but I think he, he manages to maintain both that Jews are still Jews, Gentiles are still Gentiles, although sometimes he will say former Gentiles, they haven't become Jews, but they are together part of something called the ecclesia. They're, part, they're in Christo, at least. Um, and, and so the differences remain, but they don't matter. Uh, there's a, there's a, there are distinctions that don't seem to be divisive for Paul, which is something I wish we could learn from him.